<clears throat> yeah, this game sucks, but it's okay. I found something way better. <laughs> Scratch. And there's a bunch of rip-off tower defense games like Balloons Tower Defense Simulator. Tower Defense Simulator hacked. Zero two button Rolex with tower. Someone just ripped my video. Zombies Tower Defense Simulator. There's a lot of Tower Defense Simulator games on here, and they're all kind of 2D based platforms. But there's one that stands out the most. Uh, this one right here. <laughs> Do you guys see how everything's locked except for Scout and Sniper? Just like the real game, guys. Wow. Crate shop. Twenty thousand tokens. Uh, sure. I'll get the golden crate. Wow, it does. It has the same music, the same. It's it's supposed to be three D, but it doesn't work. <laughs> it's a giant ball. And I got the worst tower of the game, and they're they're probably not gonna buff that anytime soon. This is pretty fun. You can have the same experience of getting a golden tower from Tower Defense Simulator without spinning or grinding your life away. This is so awesome, man. This is night four, night three, night two. Night one, so it has all the knights in here, but also some of the main maps as well. I'm gonna go with uh Portland, <laughs> they're all balls. Uh, I'm gonna go fallen, sure. Enemies are approaching. Look, uh, it says that they're abnormal six health. It's the exact same gameplay we have seen. I don't have any starting towers though, besides golden meaning gunner, that's the cheapest one I have. May have screwed myself over. I think I may have just lost the game. Yup, I lost the game. This is a losing screen. It's so sad. I'm doing it again, but this time with Pursuit. Pursuit is working the exact same way too. Nice. This, this game is this game is good. It, it, it's well made already, dude. I'm gonna start farming too as well. Uh, does anyone see how the top of that helicopter looks a bit weird? Am I the only one seeing that? And now we got the heavy guys with the 20% armor. Nice, which means we're gonna do even worse. I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade missiles. Do missiles actually work, dude? There's a lot of detail put into this game. Like, I know it looks like garbage, okay? But it's not garbage. Anyways, I've got my first golem mini gunner. Just gonna place him right there. It seems like Pursuit will just randomly shoot missiles out if it can't find a target. Yeah, it'll just do it like that. I guess that's cool. There's a mini gun. Oh man, it looks like crap. <laughs> it looks horrible. Please kill me. Level one, finally looking hot right there. And now we have the abnormal boss, which looks very stupid. <laughs> Look at his goggles. <laughs> we got our first stealth boy, Shadows. Okay, we need a place on Commander too. Commander, work. God, you look. You look like you want to die. I think I might lose because Golden Minigunner is just not doing a good job of killing Shadows. It's doing a really horrible job, in fact. I lost because Golden Minigunner is garbage in this game. Jesus. I just thought I'd use Golden Crook boss instead. And look, look at his Golden Crook. It spawns. It looks so stupid. Golden Crook, no! No, you murderer! I don't know if Commander works because it has a fire rate, but. I don't see them having a fiery logo. Oh yeah, no, it does work. Yeah, for, yeah, for sure it does. Yeah, golden crooks are doing way better than a stupid meeting gunner. No, the limit. I can't place. No, damn it, this game got it down. No. And now it's time for the mighty accelerator. I'm gonna place him right here next to Commander. The beam doesn't go all the way over there. And mystery guys in here give you cash. What are the color arms was press F to use so it's a hotkey and it works seems to work the exact same way except now we got some spinning circle seizure ring thing. Necromancer oh it died. We now have fallens which almost pushed through thanks to the accelerator and color arms. We did just fine. Giant boss, but pretty easy to deal with thanks to the uh, near max accelerator. Easy. And our first shadow boss, which easily gets decimated by the two accelerators. We also have our first glitches! Man, this guy did a pretty decent job at, uh, mi at making those, man. Max out all my farms, gonna max out the accelerator here too. And boom, it's the iconic purple one-eyed boy we all know and love. Man, it's so cool to see him put all his work into it. Uh, the first tank, uh, those usually kill our people. Uh, Commander, do your thing! Yeah, he died. GG. Easy. We also now have contact with the Mystery 2 boss, which aren't really a big deal. Uh, not gonna kill us. Uh, we also have the Templar, which do- Oh, man, that's so cool! It does the same exact 
the minigun thing. Although that was completely useless as a shot nowhere, it's so cool and fresh to see that, man. Is that a death animation or? Nah, 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 okay. Still cool though. And there we go, guys. I maxed out my accelerator. He's gonna place on. Hey, this is so stupid. Damn it. Summoner boss, which is gonna get bean more than likely. By the way, accelerators in this game don't really pause that much. They seem to not really care that they need to take a break. Like, sure, there's like a one second break, but then you go back to firing and. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, look, it, it got stunned. They just turned a bit black. Nice. These guys are firing in the middle. Nope. Okay. Nope. Moving my golden crooks up more just so the range could be useful. They did a call of arms on the water. Huh. Interesting. Oh, man, these arrows are punchy through. Yeah, that was close, but thankfully I got commanders. I think they do stack in this game as well. That's my cash is going up extremely fast now. Oh, well. We have the Fallen Heroes, which are just going to get an NA pretty hard. Apparently, Commander has a limit when it's not true. I can't spawn anything else besides a farm. So, this is all the attack force I got right now. This is what we got to work with. I don't know if all the commanders can stack at once. It seems like it, judging by how fast the health goes down. I really don't know. But instead of waiting for the commander cooldown to regain, I can just sell it and then use it again. And when I delete it, the stack still stays there. And I just keep doing that. Yeah, look at that little wheel of sun right there, man. This is so broken. And since I'm rich, it doesn't really matter if I lose money. Because I, no I, I have nothing else to spin it on. I mean, Fallen King has just spawned in the one and only Piggy Cheese! And everything got stunned. Cool. Uh, that's a lot of health that my towers aren't doing damage against. I really don't know if I'm going to be able to win this. I'll be honest with you fellas, no. Because of the stun mechanics just kind of ruined that right now. Some of these towers are a bit glitchy as they're black, but they still fire. Because when they're black, that means they can't work. They're stunned. Okay, time to move everything. This is the last ditch effort, dude. It's time to move everything over here. Damn it, man. Stupid ugly okay, Work, damn it! Fellas, I think it is safe to say that I lost. I lost. Damn it, man. I hate this tower limit crap. Anyways, cool game. Links in pinned comment if you want to try for yourself. Damn it, man. I hate these tower limits. How did I not bend for that? That's so stupid when you lose by that. I'm, I, I'm just so dumb.